This winter, that snow plow coming down the road after a winter storm might have a creative name and you have some area third graders to thank. I'm Ron Johnson, your neighborhood reporter at Bloomfield Elementary School, where kids got the chance to name some of them. And some of these suggestions, they're pretty creative. Meet Scoopy-Doo and Frostosaurus Rex, the newly named snowplows ready for whatever winter brings. The kids get so excited when they see their, the names on the plows. That's because they get to name them. NDOT holds a statewide naming contest for snowplows, and this year, three Bloomfield Elementary School kids came up with the perfect names for two NDOT plows in the Omaha Metro's district. Eight-year-old Javier said he turned to prehistoric inspiration. I know snowplows are tough, and uh, dinosaurs are tough, so I thought that was a good name. Fellow third graders Nathalie Manzan and Liawe Liwa were the two behind Scoopy-Doo. It's the third year NDOT's held the contest for third graders and says it's a great way to connect with the community. The kids naturally want to know everything about the big rig. How the front plow works, what we put in the back of the plows, um, how, how salt actually works. NDOT hopes this not only leaves a good impression on the kids, but their parents too. And the rest of us that will have to drive on snow-covered roads this season. And NDOT says the kids will be able to track their named snow plows when they're put into action following a winter storm that we'll most likely get at some point during this season. At Bloomfield Elementary School, I'm Ron Johnson, your Ralston neighborhood reporter.